can get a hole through the middle of the mouth. And make it a lot bigger, and a hole at the back of the head, so it brings the weight of this down considerably. Many ideas to do the claws and, and do the rest of the necklace with this. I haven't cleaned the back or done anything to the back. I'm just gonna keep on going on to this. This section of the bone uh, is what goes from the moose antler into the skull. Uh, there's two ridges that go into the top of the forehead, the back of the forehead, actually. Sorry. This is technically, I guess, you'd call moose antler ivory, but it's not ivory at all. This one knew what it was going to be, I think. Still have it on the bottom. I made up my mind if it's going to be a necklace or if it's going to be a puppet. I think it has that look where it can be a puppet. <laughs> 